Three weeks before SA093 was first detected by a shark monitoring network data recording VR2W receiver 12 kilometres off Bald Island on August 2, 2012, he'd been detected by the CSIRO Neptune Island satellite-linked VR4G receiver. To cover the 1,600 kilometres between the Neptune Islands and Bald Island, this shark must have maintained a minimum average speed of 2.8 kilometres per hour. SA093 appears to have then spent most of the next four months off southern Western Australia, travelling as far west as Hamlin Bay, where he was detected by SMN VR2W receivers about 10 kilometres offshore on August 26th. Given detections off Chatham Island between August 7th and 23rd and on September 20th, it may be reasonable to assume that SA093 spent about seven to eight weeks around southwestern Western Australia. This shark was re-detected off Bald Island during late September, late December and throughout early to mid-January 2013 before returning to the Neptune Islands on February 2nd. During his 23-day return journey to the Neptune Islands, this shark must have maintained a minimum average speed of 2.9 kilometres per hour, almost exactly the same speed as his westward journey.